the second shooting in the city last night happened minutes after whilst police was trying to process this scene on cemetery road they were called out at the Calhusa Memorial Hospital that was just minutes before 8 o'clock where upon arrival they observed three male persons and a female suffering from various gunshot wounds to their body um, the persons that were injured are Trisha Bengushe, Silvese Bahador, Michael Rekena, and Emerson Rekena. All of them sustained several gunshots wounds to their body. All of them were admitted in a stable condition. One, Trisha Bengoche, has been treated and released this morning. What police got us so far is that last night, just before 8 o'clock, all these persons, along with other persons, were in front of a Chinese store located on Central American Boulevard with Faber's Road, namely Winky Saloon Shop, when they were suddenly approached by two male persons who came on separate bicycles, and they have, after open fire, upon the group of male persons, injuring the four above-mentioned persons. Now, sir, we know that um, surveillance footage of this particular shooting has been circulating uh, on social media. Um, has the police gotten a copy from the proprietor of that business, and um, is it expected that uh, this will aid in this investigation? We had the opportunity to view some footages in the area and we are working with a different establishment to see if we can look, retrieve those footages that definitely can assist us in this investigation. This part of um, particular Faber's Road isn't the part that um, deals mostly in the trafficking of marijuana. It's um, down more towards the extension pass, uh, part um, a little bit past the substation. Um, can you speak to a motive for this particular shooting at this point? We still don't have a, a motive as to why this shooting happened. You can't say who was the target or if the group of guys were actually the, tar the, the target. Uh, we are not in a position at this moment to say if there was anybody specifically mm -hmm. who was the target. As I mentioned, it was a group of persons and the person just fired directly at the group of persons, not only to one person.